<clears throat> hey guys, Damien here, and we're going to check out some of the Between the Stars today. Uh, get this loaded up here really quick. Uh, got this from the devs, a demo of it, so you can check it out. But everything I've heard about this game so far from people has been amazing. Uh, looking forward to backing the Kickstarter myself uh, on it, <clears throat> which I'll put a link to down below in the uh, description for you guys, but everything the vi everything I've seen in the videos and pictures and everything with this game looks amazing, so I really am looking forward to really trying this out. Uh, there. Says demo version. Says this is demo version under development. You may find bugs, errors, etc. So, go to settings really quick. We're on ultra settings. That looks good to me. Uh, VSync. Turn the VSync off because my monitor doesn't have it anyways. Or no, geez, it doesn't have G-Sync. Doesn't matter, regardless. We're gonna turn it off. <clears throat> okay. So let's go into the prologue here. Choose my captain, Jane Scott or James Scott. Mm, let's do Jane. I've heard different captains get different abilities, so we'll try her first. engines are okay. One's on fire. Move the mouse wheel up to increase. Well, that's a different way to do it. Mouse wheel up to increase throttle and mouse wheel down to reverse. I actually like that though. That's actually a really cool idea. Moderate damage. Engines operation. That makes thrust. That makes your thrust come almost like a thrust uh, throttle stick, kind of. Let's see. We got Q and E to hold. Turn left and right. Um, A and D rotates. That I would kind of wish to change, only because I like Q and E for rotating, and A and D for left and right. But and then yeah. Navigation systems operational. Typical. Testing power systems. I can push the rock away, that's awesome. Up arrow to assign all energy to weapons. Okay. Left arrow to all energy. Left arrow to assign all energy to engines. <coughs> okay, it's over there, okay. Well, that should give me. Oh yeah, see we're moving. We got up and go a little faster there. I'm looking for the throttle on the. I don't see a. Th oh, okay, there it is. Okay. So where it says power there, it turns green for forward and red for reverse, and all energy to shields. Let's bump my shields up here. Power distribution correct. Alright, 
they're like a. Captain, we're detecting warp signature right. in the Enemies. We've been followed. Prepare for attack. I'm prepared for attack. All right. Oops. Let's go. X to look behind you. Okay. I wish I'd done that before. <coughs> Single fire part of the ship allow you to destroy the shields quicker. Make evasive maneuvers. This might be easier with an Xbox controller. I should probably plug mine in to see. Or at least if I can put controls to... Okay, where are they? Come on. All power to shield, you can't hurt me. Looks like. It may take a little longer to kill you, but. This ship is pretty badass. I wasn't in battle, I'd plug my Xbox controller in and try it, but... Uh, come on, up, 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 not down, up! Captain, reinforcements incoming. We need more firepower. No, we don't! Trust me, we do not need more firepower. We need more defense, so we don't get destroyed ourselves. Oh, shit! That kind of hurts a little though, whatever that was. This might not be easier with an Xbox controller now that I think about it. The, the flying might be, but not the... Heck, nuclear missile? Oh shit! <coughs> Two plus left mouse button. So come on, rotate so I can see them. I nuked one. But... Okay, so you have to hold. Okay, I see how to do it. Thank you. 
but the enemy bypass our shields. Two casualties confirmed. Salvage an enemy ship. In order to salvage, fly close to ship, place your curve when the ship becomes holographic. <laughs> Lots of ships to salvage here. Salvage all these. Okay, I got that. Go to this one. We'll get to that. I'm salvaging the ships right now. Music is really nice in this, too. Slow down just a hair. Avoid you. Complete 180. Two there and one up there. Which one of you is closer? <coughs> Oops. I smacked it. Here, get off me. That is cool though that you can accidentally run into the ship. I'm assuming take damage. Yep, see, I took damage to the shields. I love that when a game does that. Or like when you're too close to a ship and it explodes and you take damage. I mean, because come on, if you're right next to a reactor going off, you're going to take damage. It's not like, oh, you know, my shields are going to block it all. Unless it's like a tiny, tiny ship and you're like some giant capital ship. But you're still going to at least take a little damage to the shields, even. There. Let's cut power to engines. Whoops. Pull the inventory. What do we got? One. Gatling of the Republic Mark I. Nuclear missile launcher. Light plasma, light plasma, light cannon, light cannon. Damn. Let's open this one. Bodies. A shotgun. That's okay. Open. Money. Resources are always good. Ooh, a new gun. Wait. Why did it put it over there? I'm confused. Why did it put my gun over here? <coughs> Tasks. Did it, like, level up a gun or something?
common. Common. And Brian Smith. So that's Ah, <coughs> uh, okay, let's see. So, I got a shotgun. I don't think I want a shotgun at the moment. I like having the range here, so. I don't know where that other gun went that I got. Can't add any crew members there. Projectiles. I have two openings, unfortunately. So he's like a weapons person, it seems like. The engineers are better at salvaging. Scientists are better at salvaging up here, too, so... I have mostly projectiles right now, so let's increase my projectile damage. That would probably be a better idea at the moment. System analysis. Critical. Repairs needed immediately. Okay. All right. I Mine, what's our current position? We are currently in the Thalus 6 sector. It is on the outskirts of the Interstellar Republic headquarters. We should be able to reach it using our drive engines. Preparing warp drive. Oh, now that's pretty awesome. Where am I supposed to be going? The Tosset sector. Warp drive engines damaged. Jump impossible. Damn it. My, which is the closest space station in this sector? It's the trade station and Terrace port. Okay. Set in the coordinates. Coordinates sent. Full speed to the Allied station. Yeah, I would definitely give the option to use Q and E to roll because controlling the ship would be a lot easier using A and D for the side to side and Q and E for rolling. That's what most space games seem to do. I know it's bad to compare it to other games, but it's just what's used. Everyone's used to, and it seems you know. I'm curious. Let's plug in the Xbox controller and see what happens. Is there support? Mine. Situation report on Antero's port. Accessing bandwidth. 
This station serves as a crucial hub for business tycoons and mining sector speculators. It has a large port specialized for trade freighters that return full of materials from mining settlements. They also swear they have the best beef soup recipe in the universe. Out of warp or drop out of quantum drive. If I have to dock with this thing, that's gonna suck. Like, you know, like if I had to go to that single spinning green thing. Okay. How do I dock it? Captain Scott from the Fifth Republic Fleet here. We request docking permission. Station control tower here. Dock at the assigned bed. Over. Fuck you! Coordinates. Establishing communication. Docking protocol prepared. This would be so much easier if I could switch the commands around. Oh, we're getting pretty close there. Quite as hard as I thought it would be. The dock, but it would be easier if the controls were swapped there. It's a, at least an option to have it to swap it, you know. Time should I'll give you a completely operational ship. Head escort. We'll arrive before the visit starts. Store. Hand over corpses of any dead crew members and equip the Antares freighter.
on my ship. Cloaking generator, mine launcher, pulse generator. Um, why is my ship different? Oh, that's the station. That's why. Everyone to their posts. We must find that missing freighter. Captain, oh shit! Do you think it could have been an attack? It's strange. If it had been an attack. The security systems would have asked for a security detail from the station, and they would have come to its aid. They could have used a signal inhibitor to cut communications. The asteroid cluster where the ship was seen doesn't correspond to any commercial route. Decree M-22, under Republic law, restricts commercial routes in order to guarantee the safety of its freighters. This behavior would be a direct violation of Organic Space Law 412, Section 2-08. Well, this ship is a little bit nimbler, it seems. I definitely, yeah, see that, yeah, that needs to be changed. There's got to be a way to change that. There's not a settings for, no. Yeah, I need a control settings. I really need a control settings. Back. Oh, that's so nice. Stay cloaked. We've arrived at the freighter's last known coordinates, Captain. There doesn't appear to be anything here. My, can you scan the area? I detect irregular radiation readings coming from the middle of the cluster. Let's take a look. What is this? Captain, we found the source of the radiation. We should proceed to scan. Affirmative. My, prepare the analysis module. Preparing the scan system. What is this? I'm supposed to be scanning that thing, okay. <coughs> yeah, these controls are really bad for steering. Don't get me wrong, I love it. I 
This looks like the result of an attack. Mike, can you follow the radiation signature? Comparing samples. Similar readings found in nearby coordinates. Establishing route. Warp or quantum. Cut down. Three ships there. Captain, we're being hailed. Shall we accept the call? Affirmative. Ex Cleo, commander of the Starship Insurrection of the Pirate Fleet here. I order your immediate retreat. This frigate is now under our control. Surrender, or we'll open fire. This is the captain of the warship Genesis of the Interstellar Republic. I demand you halt your activities immediately. Captain Scott? Of the warship Genesis? In that hunk of chunk? <laughs> you asked for it. Crew Tar! Shit, you kidding me? Salvage. Captain, the ship's remains correspond to the freighter we've been searching for. We have to look for survivors, and confirm the shipment was in fact stolen. Preparing to board. Oh my god. This is going to be very difficult. Up, 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 up. 
the last. Right, let's go forward some and then. I know there's a third one. Where'd it go? Down. This way. Come on. valuables Heavy Laser Mark Three. That's definitely being saved because, um, yeah, that doesn't need to disappear with my current ship. I don't know what, what kind of does it tell me what class this ship is I'm flying right now. That is something that would be really nice to have also. Like, you know, like right here somewhere. To say, you know, whatever class ship it is, you know, that would be really nice to have too. The information of. I mean, I could be missing it somewhere, you know, but. I seem to like to screw ships up, that's for sure. What is B? Huh, that's a bug report. I miss map. What's it? I is inventory and P is picture. I really like the I like the screenshots options. Please wait.
Let's go back to the station to inform Susan. What kind of pirates assault a protonite freighter just to abandon it? x players weapons do not correspond to the radiation we've been following. Captain, the coded data seems to follow the same pattern obtained in the slaver's base. Our team can't undertake an investigation. We haven't found enough matches. How long you can use it for? All right, we're getting there. <laughs> Full speed. I know they want to have the special skins for people too, but being able to paint your ship would be really nice too. Station control tower here. Dock at the assigned bed. Over. Receiving coordinates. Establishing communication. Docking protocol prepared. <clears throat> It's actually a really amazing game. I mean, look at that shit. <sighs> the only complaint I have really is the controls. Just the ability to modify them would be really nice, you know? I like how it has the docking. Like I said, I just wish I could control it slightly easier, that's all. do that. Rob Pyronite Department. Build an ion reactor. Wanda Diaz. Build. There we go. An iron reactor mark one. That's how raw pyronite too. Damn. Contract. Uh, 
don't know why this one's 1250 and this one is 1875. I mean, it's the same weapon. One was like a Mark One, and one was a Mark Two. That would be different, but well, we have a long way to go. We should depart. Engines on maximum drive. Unauthorized order. You lack bridge privileges. So now I have a babysitter? Is the Republic sending you to watch over me? It's a matter of security, Mr. Huggins. The last Protonite shipment was assaulted. Captains are not what they used to be. If a pirate ship attacked me, there wouldn't be enough space for them to hide. We're sure of that. Needs kind of some more info on the cloak and stuff too, like like Star Trek, where when you cloak, your shields go down, so you're taking more damage to the hull, or I'm so curious what these other. transport ships are not ours. It seems they found a more interesting intermediary than your company, Mr. Huggins. This can't be. We have to register this immediately.
Um, P to get to photo mode, maybe? When the foreman finds out, heads will roll! station now what happened i forgot my lunch mr huggins false alarm i found it <sighs> captain there's no sign of activity on the station it looks completely abandoned we should dock and discover what's going on here i'll stay on the ship uh uh, covering your backs. That's what I'm talking about, the whole steering right there, I could've... Okay. Where's the docking spot? I can't even see this station because... Try to turn. Let's see if we can get close enough to dock this time. Even the little tiny details, like those little tiny jets they're firing, that make these small adjustments. Survivors are generators. We want power so we can find the survivors easier, but... allows the energy to flow temporary. Okay.
Okay. So, we've looked over the station. There are no survivors. But, but this can't be happening. We have to inspect the last station. I think I've had enough. We should head back. This oversteps your jurisdiction, Mr. Huggins. You can come with us, or you can stay here. You decide. This is an outrage! You guys are kidnapping me! Preparing the jettison hatch for immediate exit. All right, fine. I'll go with you. Interceptor laser. Okay, so that's what that is. Let's warp out of here, boys. And girls. I went to your post. The station is under attack. I told you we should have gone back. We can still turn the ship around. Control yourself, Mr. Holmes. We won't abandon any innocents. Crew, stay alert. We'll hold off the enemy attack. Sir, yes, sir. Controller does not work, by the way, also. I plugged it in. It won't recognize it, so... It's salvage time.
Captain, the corrupt transmission corresponds to the rest of the data patterns. Is it possible to begin an investigation, Crewman Burton? The science team currently believes we have enough data to decode everything. We will begin right away. Understood. Search data. Add crew members. Our work here is done. Let's head back to the station. I think I need a vacation. Oh my god, cut the engines. Quantum leap here, quantum jump, whatever you want to call it. Target lock. And here we go. Why did it knock me out of the jump? Control tower here. Dock at the assigned bay. Over. Receiving coordinates. Establishing communication. Docking protocol prepared. Slow down a hair so we can get this lined up right. There we go. Docking com almost complete.
Captain, our scanners detect multiple signals in the area. Maybe we should investigate them before warping to Tacit Stella. Perhaps someone needs our help. Oh, shotgun Mark IV, damn. That thing hits hard. Cloaking generator. A radar. Shield generator. And a pulse generator, why not? Three shield generator. Stop any. Sell that back. I'm in my giant ship again. Yay! Stress signal, suspicious activity. activity first. Oh yes, I can cloak this giant beast.
can't open my inventory while well in. Excuse me. See any more remaining things? Let's warp to that section. Whee! Oh, my engines are burning again. Investigation has finished. We've been able to restore the transmission we picked up in the slaver's headquarters. I think you need to hear this immediately. Nartos, Fleet Admiral of the Children of the Sun here. Situation report, Commander. Commander X Pleo from Lithobia 1 here. All preparations are complete as per your orders. Perfect. The Galactic Summit is nearly upon us. The wrath of the Children of the Sun shall fall upon the Interstellar Republic. We have to relay this as soon as possible. Understood, Admiral. Although there's something that worries us. A captain of the Republic is snooping around the sector. We followed him after his warp jump, but he destroyed our ships. Take care of him as soon as possible. Now is the time for us to control the mining and commerce network. Send a pirate fleet and make sure that the protonite mining stations are under our control and that none of the Republic stations are supplied. Break their will, and if necessary, kill them all. Summit Admiral Xiao. The Children of the Sun no longer receive orders from the Interstellar Republic. What is the meaning of this, Nardos? For centuries, the Children of the Sun have been subjected to the whims of the Republic. That time has come to its end. We order your retreat and complete demilitarization of your strategic points across the universe. We've looked out for the security and common interests of the universe for hundreds of years. We won't cave into the scare tactics of a few bloodthirsty savages. Just a few, Admiral? We've been complacent for too long, but that's over now. The Children of the Sun will no longer be led by an unworthy puppeteer. It's time to cut those cables and strangle their detractors with them to the last. Admiral, this is high treason. Opposition to the Republic like this means a death penalty to anyone who supports your rebellion. Negotiations have ended, Xiao. Surrender or die. Not us. Be reasonable. This means war on a universal scale. Millions will die. The decision has been made, Xiao. May the sun light your way, Admiral. attacking the headquarters.
Captain, our shields have been damaged. We won't hold out much longer. This controls would be so much easier if I could control it. Shields have fallen. Come on, guys. Time to get evasive here. The children of the sun are focusing all their fire on the station. The I'd love to do something about it, but I can't zero steer. Zero five seven percent. Everything I can at the moment. The armor around one of our engines has been destroyed. Structural damage to the headquarters. Explosion imminent. The space station has been destroyed. This can't be happening. You'll pay for this. Do you hear me? You will pay for this, even if it's the last thing I do. I'll get you if I have to follow you to the end of the universe. Captain, snap out of it. We need you more than ever now. Get my front shields up! Get those front shields up! Don't do that, do you hear me? I forbid the closing of those bay doors! 
Situation analysis. Systems completely destroyed. Crew, crew dead. I see. So this is it, right? MAR system. Protocol error. D -d damage. Easy. I'm here with you. Rest, Lyle. Rest. Well, we kind of beat them, I guess. I was actually really badass. Like I said, guys, the uh, I'll put a link to the thing. I'll put a link to the uh, Steam and a link to the Kickstarter. Uh, on the Kickstarter, there is also a link. On the Kickstarter, there is a link to where you can get the demo to play this as well. Uh, it's a really amazing game. And thank you guys for coming out and checking it out with us. And we'll catch you guys next time.